What is going on, you damn folios? It is your boy back again with another episode of Prison Architect as we continue to build our big, beautiful, little mini city. Now, today, we need to seriously look at making some money. I'm a little bit worried right now, not because of the money situation, the fact that we got 20 grand about to arrive with nine prisoners. One of them is a legendary prisoner. Our prison is not equipped for anything above minimum security. <laughs> I'm just going to throw that out right now. Um, everyone lives together, which, um, you know, high security prisoners don't like that. Our guards don't have the adequate equipment to deal with riots and all that jazz. And we don't really have the facilities to keep people behind bars. <laughs> they could break out very easily if they wanted to. So, there's, a new, there's one or two ways to look at this. One, just accept the fact that they're all going to break loose, damage, riot, and escape. Accept the fact that's, that that's going to happen. In return, I'm going to get big dollar bills from accepting these high security prisoners, which will fund future expansions. So there's always that way I can kind of look at it. But anyway, welcome back, guys. If you are enjoying this series, smash that like button down below. If you're new in here, make sure you do subscribe so you get notified next time I come out. But today, I want to... Uh, build the, I believe it is the forestry, right? Uh, the forestry allows us to kind of plant a load of trees, grow them, then sell the wood, which is huge. Huge, 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 as well as maybe doing some of the farming as well. Yeah. Could be interesting, we'll see. I'm going to use this space down here. This is eventually going to be used for more houses and apartments and stuff like that for the prisoners. But I can't do any more until I've expanded anyway. So, we need some funds coming in. Uh, last episode we did stuff like setting up our gym. Built a new yard, which I'm going to expand upon this a little bit more. Built more mansions, which has really upped our population up to 96. Let's go. Built our little police station as well, ready for the armory when we start training uh, our guards. And we've got a little bit of the uh, carpentry stuff set up as well. Now, these new prisoners are going to be coming in very soon. In an hour and 40 minutes in the game. I might wait till they come in because... Oh, you know, that's a good point. I just realized in my head. Uh, do I have any gang members at the moment? Hold on, where is it? Deployment, intelligence, gangs. I have no gang members. Which is understandable because you only really get gang members from higher level security prisoners. But I wonder with these coming in right now if any of them would be gang affiliated. Hmm. This is sparking my interest. Right, in, in they come. They have now arrived. And what's going on here? Why is this dude got that symbol? I don't know what that symbol means, to be honest with you. Are any of them gang related? Uh, no. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. But we've been paid out anyway. We've been paid out. And which one of our prisoners is the... Do we not get to know? Unknown reputation. Oh, is it this dude here? He's tough. He's wearing a suit, so I assume he is the legendary prisoner. Uh, expect riots now, guys. Expect some serious riots to now happen. So, we're just going to have to take it on the chin, unfortunately. We're going to take it on the chin. So, let's set some stuff up then. I'm going to get now... Do I have any grants on the go? I don't. So, we're going to get set up then. Uh, e basic farming could be a good one. I mean, it will allow us to kind of do stuff. But do we have a grant for the... Um, what's it called? The forestry. I don't think we do. We have this carpentry one, but I don't think anyone's working on the carpentry side just yet. So we'll kind of wait for that. Let's get this basic farming set up, because the... Um, the, the forestry can be done very, 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 very easily. It's just a case of rooms where's forestry there and if i just designate this area to begin with they'll start planting down some trees i don't think you can logistically apply prison labor to it no is there anywhere recently that i could do prison labor that i've kind of missed out on no i think we're all good okay sweet so oh got some auto save on the go Auto saves on the go. 
While they escort those prisoners and while they all slowly settle in, we're going to then work with this area. So the forestry, will slowly they'll slowly build the trees themselves. But we're going to do this. So hire the farmer worker in the staff member section. So we'll get one farmer worker. There we go. So farmer will handle all jobs related to farming. They also require to teach inmates to perform these jobs. So we can get the farmers to do everything or we can hire um, prisoners to do it, which is pretty good. Oh, six grand in early release. 35 big ones? Whew, we are raking in the cash. So correctly build a functional vegetable allotment, a fruit orchard, a farming field, and then plant five of uh, plant five crops of any type in each room. That sounds fairly easy, right? He says. He says. So rooms, uh, we'll do it all here. So I'll do my. We'll do it like a. Uh, let's go for a ten by ten with the vegetable. We'll do a ten by ten. With the fruit. And then. 10 by 21 with the farming. So these are just going to be here right now. For us to grind out the money. So we've zoned them off. Each one looks like it requires a shed. So a shed is just here. It's fine with your pot. So I'll place the shed. In the top corners of each room. In that sense. And uh, we'll let them build all that and let it all happen. So we just spent a ton of cash right now on getting the tree saplings all ready to be planted. And I can't remember who actually plants them, whether it is the the gardeners or the workers. Oh, snap. Look at how many um, customers we've got in here. I might need to do some more prison labor. I'll get in two, three, four. So I've got one, two, three, four, ten workers in total. Not so many people want to come to the bakery. That's good though, because it means I can serve more customers, generate more money. That's interesting. That's interesting. Um, it, it, it's the gardeners who plants. Okay, okay, okay. So we're gonna need the uh, the plumbing coming down here then. So I'm gonna run the plumbing all the way down. And it's hard to tell where the gap space is. Is it here? Hold on. Oh, that road goes all the way down. So utility-wise, we want this to run all the way in. Oh, that's perfect. Perfection. And then I'm just going to run this piping down here. So I can get the small piping coming off. And then we have water to the sheds. Nice. So lots of stuff to build right now. Lots of stuff to be built. Uh, we're still generating money, which is going to be good to see. And it'll take a while before these trees start to grow to the point where we can then sell them. And then start generating revenue from the wood that gets produced. Now, staff members, I'm going to hire a few more gardeners. I'm going to hire up to 10 because we are starting to get more grass, more plants and stuff like that kind of dotted around. And if we're going to have this forestry, we're going to need more of them to kind of help us out with the plant in that kind of situation. So, keep it going. We're going to get 1,800 at the moment for the next day. Which is down to one of each of the security levels of prisoners. Things seem to be alright. They seem to be okay at the moment. But I think it's because everyone's on work free time. So everyone's like keeping busy. It's what happens when they're locked up. Or whether they're in their prison cell. Or stuff that means they're, they're kept in one room and can't move and behind bars we'll see what happens we'll see what happens right is all the waterworks now been done i believe so so how does this work then um right see oh we require we need to unlock farming and forestry labor oh i gotta get hang on let me undo that one right is that which one's now going down Are these going to happen? Is my um, warden 
Who is it that rec who does this? Oh, he's linked to the maintenance dude. Where's the maintenance? Oh, I think the maintenance dude's on break. He is. Yeah, that's why it's not um, being researched right now. So him coming back. So once he gets back into his office, there we go. There we go. He's doing forestry first. Okay, so forestry labor means that we can get workers in there, which is pretty good. Right, it's currently eat time right now. How loaded is this canteen? Oh, there's been a death already. Uh, killed for being a snitch? Oh, no. Oh, no. Another dude just died. Killed for being a snitch. Oh, well, they do say snitches do get stitches. That's not good. That's that's not good. Right, I need to do some more patrols then, don't I? So if I have a patrol here... And assign a guard. And then set some more patrols up. So we'll have one here coming through. Right. I'm trying to think where else we would kind of need them. So obviously definitely having one here. Assign the guard. There we go. Where else would we need them? Where else would be kind of important? I mean, we've got them going around here, the majority of the area. I reckon eventually having one going back and forth in front of these houses would be a good shout. Maybe coming down just to here, just to kind of mix things up. I do want them separate. I don't want that one too long, do I? I'm trying to dot them around to where they'll be the most handy. I'm going to get one going across here. I don't want to connect them. I just always want one flowing around. You know what I mean? So, assign a guard. Assign a guard. Assign one there. And I've only got 20 guards, so I think it would be also handy to hire an additional five. Right, additional five guards. Okay. Um, right, fast forward then. So at least there's always somebody on hand just to kind of um, call it a day on some of their riots when they kick off in time. Uh, anyway, that's kind of sidetracked me from what I was doing over here. So it is becoming nighttime right now very soon. So objects-wise... Oh, no, I can't do anything because I'm researching. That's, okay. that's what I was waiting for. I was waiting for the stuff to be researched. So it's getting the last few moments of work in before... Oh, oh, hold on. I've got a freaking hole up here. Remove the tunnel, please. So we're going to get 4,600 on the next day. This is the benefit of accepting higher risk prisons. It's just... Bigger stuff can go down. Right, there we go. Get rid of all of them tunnels, please. And it's work time, and now it's time to sleep. So they're all going to run off to their beds. While we fix the tunnels, the researching for farm is now underway. So we should now be able to, for deployment, not deployment, logistics, prison labor. So, okay, so I can't do prison labor. So what was, what was the forestry all about then? I like you to put prisoners to work in a forestry via the logistics menu. Forestry area must be enclosed for prisoners. Science work them prevent escapes. Be aware that prisoners will also require access to delivery areas in order to replant trees. Okay, so if they require access to delivery areas, I'm then going to have to sort out the entrance point, aren't I? So if I just freeze for a second and then de-assign my whole delivery area here, right... And then if I just quickly do some... No, actually not new flooring. I'm going to designate then. See, this is something I didn't really think of. But it's not a problem. It ain't a problem. I'm just going to make sure that the delivery section is within our grasps. So... One, two, three. Two, two, two. Right, should be like that. It should be fine. Delivery area. 
Everything's all there. Okay, good stuff. So then what I was going to do then is... Oh, no, it's in doors, isn't it? Doors. The road gate. So if I had that there... And then this one here... It does mean I'm going to have to reconfigure all the other zoning sections at the minute as well. So if I get rid of the zoning for them... Uh, and then we'll have the garbage area, just to say, just here. And then the exports. Where's the exports now? Just there. I put just here. So then the walls and fences, I could do a concrete wall. Now let's just go for your standard brick. Standard brick wall him. To enclose everybody. And then to make it easier for us, I'm going to... Oh, never, we've had another death. What's this death all about this time? Oh, it's a guard murdered with a prisoner by a baton. It was you. Well, that's not good. That's not good. When is it ever going to be good? But I need to assign... Going back and forth, a guard out here. So we can have someone who can open the gates when needed. Oh, there's multiple deaths. There's multiple deaths. Who is the... Who is the... Who are you? How do you have a baton and beating everybody up? Also, uh, lock open. I just realised I haven't locked all of these open. I just realised this. Uh, lock open... Lock open, lock open, lock open. We're gonna have so many deaths right now. Don't kill the doctor. Don't kill the doctor right now. The doctor don't want to go in there. Um, right. How many guards is he gonna wreck? I've had eight deaths, all of them being guards. I'm going to have to hire some more guards. Right, there are eight guards now back. We're going to train our guards up. This is the only... This is the... the oh, that dude's going crazy. They're fighting. This is the only downside to having high-risk security prisoners. Our guards don't have the adequate equipment to be dealing with these situations. But... When you break it down right now, my delivery area... Um, is it logistics? No, intelligence, deployment, shared area. So they now should be able to go through here through prison labor, right? So why is the foresty area still not available for prisoners? I don't know. I don't know. But they're able to work in the farming areas anyway. So that is my other benefit. So objects then. Let's get this stuff done. So we'll start with the vegetable allotment. And we'll go with a couple of carrots. So I'll go one, two, three, four, five, six. Some cabbages. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um... Uh, some potato plants. Some tomatoes. And that's all uh, applied to crop fields. Can I just... Right, I, plant I planted down some compost. <laughs> right. Oh, fruit orchard. So we got an apple tree. We can have a banana tree, a pear tree, and an orange tree. Okay. And then when it comes to the farming field itself, now what? what's the difference between this farming field and, say, like a fruit or vegetable allotment? Oh, is it like wheat and stuff? Is that like the difference? Uh, oh, wheat and barley and corn. So, barley. Oh, 
I'm gonna do a nice double row. Actually, I'm gonna do a triple row. Wheat. Can't be grown everywhere, by the looks of it. And then corn. So why can't I grow here? Right, I'm designating all of this here. To be dirt. And I just realised how small the room actually is. Room. Farming field. Flooring. Dirt. It does make sense. It makes sense. Right, there's a lot of stuff to get done right now. There is a lot of stuff. The prison's all over the place. <laughs> it really is all over the place right now. And I'm going to have to train my prisoners to be a little bit tougher. If I can give them tasers, they'll have a little bit of ammunition to fight against people. So that's the only benefit. Uh, logistics then. Prison labor. One, two, three, four, five. One, two... One, two, three, four, because there's more there. We'll do six, seven. Requires farm work safety. Okay, so let's get that program set up then. So farm work safety uh, here. So if I'm, oh, in a classroom. I don't have a classroom set up yet. Hmm. Okay. Okay. We do have a... Do we still have the farmer or is he dead? No, we still have a farmer. So I think the farmer might come out and kind of start planting some stuff down one by one. He might be on his lunch break or something at the moment. Is he? Because I don't know where the farmer is. Oh, no, there he is. The farm will do it at the minute. Until, obviously, I have a school. But I'll complete this grant anyway in just a moment. I just realised I need far, five of each one. So I need another tree in, in the... Uh, Oh, he's already qualified that that um that that dude. Oh, there we go. We got another tree in there, so we'll be able to plant it. So some are qualified by the looks of it. So that's kind of handy. Oh, compost as well. I forgot about that. A little bit of compost in my life. And the corn patch. By a three. Let me just fill out the rest of the, the wheat section. Uh, that will do. So these are my makeshift money makers. These are my makeshift money makers. They can earn revenue when they grow and, be, and can be harvested without any additional kind of uh, things needing to be done. So I gotta wait for the rest to be planted before we can go any more further. Uh, right, okay, good stuff. So we've had more deaths. It always seems to be happening up here. Oh, killed for being a snitch. we got to hire informatives and stuff, don't we? We really do. Find out these snitches and put them into witness protection. It's quite a tough one to do that. It really is. So while that's all going to make me money in the long run, which I'm quite excited for, I won't judge it up just yet. What other grants can I take on that will kind of help me out? Now, see, the guard dogs would help me in a sense of they will sniff out the tunnels. But I also need my kind of prison guards to be a little bit tougher. Now, to be a little bit tougher, I'm going to need an armory. Then I'm going to need tasers, body armor. Then we need to roll out the tasers. So everyone can get one. I'm going to eventually need guard towers. So we'll start with the armory. And move forward that way. Uh, to all clean up. It's still going to be tough to do. While I don't have a perimeter wall correctly all set up. Just at the minute. Um, reform here. Bureaucracy. This is all classroom stuff. I don't have the space for a school just yet. Government raid. No. Grant. Oh visitation. See visitation would be a good one to get set up. It's going to require a couple of things right now to build a visit. Well, the only thing left I need to do is build a visitation room and add a pool table. 
Now my visitation room is going to take place here. So planning wise, it is going to take place here right now. It's going to close up this whole area. And in terms of objects for the visitation, I want the one. Let me type it in. Vis oh. The visitor booth. It's not as good as your standard visitor table, but no contraband can be passed through, but also it does need electricity. So I've got to plan out in terms of objects how this is going to work, because obviously people are coming from this side, uh, prisoners from this side, so I need to figure it all out, what the best system would be for us. So I reckon... I reckon I can create a system. Like if I use it as walls here. So if I keep a two wide gap there, two wide gap there, and then run that down. One, two, three, one. What's that going across? That's a four. And then what's that there? That's a nine. So that five section. should be the middle point a four and a four so I could then run that back down there that back down there and then we have this like inlet section walk in do the visitation it feels a bit funky it feels a bit funky I might pull it back by one Like that. Like that. See, that one wouldn't really work out too well. One, two, three. One, two, three. It doesn't really play out too well unless then I made it a bit bulkier there a bit bulkier here and then chose a section like that to cut in come down by there and there so that's a free right in my head I'm trying to design a decent to one two three a decent setup so I can create this horseshoe shape where inmates, inmates are around this way, we have all the kind of visitation set up, and then people enter from here, the, the civilians. Thus eliminate, eliminating any issues we would have with passing contraband. Thus also maximizing the amount of space we have available. Hmm. I'm still not 100% on this, but it will still work. It's just going to enable or help out the need for, what is it, family, isn't it? Even though they, they get like the phone calls and stuff like that they can do. This will just take it to the next level. We do, we, at the minute we have, uh, where is it, where is it, 90 families waiting to visit. So that just goes to show you. So, right, walls and doors, doors. Let me just pause the game for a second. So we can have normal doors leading into it. One there. And then that one will go there. But then we'll have on this side, jail doors. No, it doesn't have to be jail doors, does it? Well, there's not really a center point for any of this. So I'm going to do it, bam, bam, with a little gap in the middle. Why not? Why not? Funky designs. Funky designs. Right, they should be able to build this pretty quick, but the problem I've got is that is a very, very easily accessible way to kind of escape the prison right now. 
So I'm now waiting for this room to be built. And why am I waiting so long? There we go. Oh, I think my next issue is that these are uh, fences and not brick walls. Okay. So without pressing play, visitation. Objects. These visitor booths. Oh, they're chunkier than I thought. Okay, let me see how this would look. So if I did like this style. Oh, well, how much are they? A thousand? Oh, okay. I was not expecting that. I was not expecting that. Oh my god. <laughs> so obviously this will go here. And so on and so on. So I was not ready for that. I'll be honest with you. And my prisoners are going to find it very, very easy to escape in just a moment. So I need to build a brick wall. I'm in trouble. I'm in serious trouble. Now, can I just get them to quickly... Ob no, rooms, uh, things. Uh, I'm panicking now. Dismantle objects. And instead... Build that. And then... Um, deployment. Um, staff only in here. Okay, right. No one needed to escape just then. Jesus. That was, that was, that's ridiculous, isn't it? We're not ready for that visitation room. Not for the way that I want to build it. We are not ready for it. Uh, objects, visitation, visit, visitor booth. It would go like that. And then on this side, like that. Right, we'll build what we can afford. Because there's going to be a wall across there. Two. There's going to be a wall across here. And a wall across here. There's no question about that. Question is though, can what's remaining on that power supply be utilized for this I don't think it's possible I don't think it's possible so I'm going to have to kind of change up how the power gets connected oh so I'm going to dismantle them utilities there yikes okay Dismantle all of them. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to dismantle the pipe work right now. For the simple fact of I need to dis I need to reroute the electrical grid. But then I gotta get this back in. But then I've also got to dismantle this. Oh my god. This is painful to watch. Sorry, guys. All that, just because the, the power supply was underneath. Uh, so, in reality, then, if I then run... I'm going to connect this to a new power supply. All I've got to do is run it to there. Run that up into here and just leave it there for now. Right, objects. I've got eight grand. Eight grand to build eight more of these. That's as far as I can take it. I didn't realize this was going to be so expensive doing it the way I want it to be done. But this is the only way I can guarantee that no um, contraband is going to be passed through. 
It's the only way I, the only way I can guarantee it. But as my farm doing anyway, they're starting to chop down some trees, which is looking good. So we can then start to export those goods. So are they exporting them? Yes, they are. Export's been taken. There's $200 there. Some wood. Sometimes they like to take the wood to over here for the carpentry, which is understandable. I haven't seen anybody use that just yet. Oh, also, if I build a pool table, then I've uh, I've completed the goal for the grant. I'm going to build the pool table for the staff. That's a kick in the teeth, isn't it? So, I've got no grants now. All my grants are then done. I've generated maximum monies. So how far can I now get then with the remainder of these visitation tables? Oh, hang on. This might be it. I might be done. Yeah. Okay, I'm all done here. So, waiting to build that, I need to build a new power supply. Oh, I need five grand for that. Jesus. Okay. And I also need to make sure that the deployment... Are these treated as separate buildings? Not just yet. Oh, we've had some escapes. Of course we have. We always seem to have escapes. Not a lot I can do about these, unfortunately. Right, waiting for... the last few bits to be done. Oh my god. That is some distance right there, boys. Right, finally. It's now as two separate areas. So... Oh, don't... How do I want this to be set up? Um... Alright, let's keep it as it is. Doors. Doors, 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 doors. Back to how we was going to have it originally. Oh, I've got enough of the powers as well. well I can't build it there, apparently. But I can build it here. And then for the capacitors... I'll go for it to be built, but I then place down the capacitors. Okay, built. That couldn't have been any louder in my ears. Whoa, what's going on? Why did it do that? That was weird. Right, I'm going to take some of these rooms off this as well and eventually put it onto that to kind of separate the power supplies a bit. There's so many deaths. We have a parole officer that got beat up. Oh my god. Do I want to know? I don't know if I do. I don't know if I do, but I'm hoping with me giving them visitation, it's going to change things for the good. Right, we should have some light in here soon. We should have some lights when they've built the remainder of those stuffs. There we go. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. So now visitation can happen. Another death. Oh, no. I didn't realize we're going to need patrols in the gym as well. The only good thing is, it means I'm going to get more money tomorrow. <laughs> Right, patrols. Get some gym patrols down. Get a guard in here. I mean, it makes sense. There's not really anybody over here right now. Um, okay, so... Visitation is down. Flooring wise, let me just sort the concrete out. 
for this area. I think it's time we sort, sort the main entrance out. And what type of floor do we do in here? Like a nice little wooden floor. Would be nice, wouldn't it? How much do you cut? Oh, okay, maybe not. I'm going to do a concrete floor for the prisoner side. And a wooden floor for the visitor side. Can't afford anything else. I always push it too far, don't I? I always have to push it too far. But it will look good when it's done. It will look good when it's done. So I'm kind of excited to see them use this. So now the visitation's got power, we should start to see them using it. It probably will happen the next day. Another death. Oh, it's another guard. Oh, did they not sort these tunnels out? Oh, insufficient funds. We must have run out of money when we tried to do all the tunnels. Can we just focus on this one here? Because then that will at least make the, um, the dormitory work again. That's allowing us to have more prisoners coming in to make it a big chunk of change. See, that looks good when you separate it like that. We give, uh, we give the civilians the luxury. But the prisoners, not so much. It's very dark. We need lights out here. So how are we doing in terms of revenue? What we're kind of... I know I'm spending it all, but... We've had... 14,000 in exports yesterday. So that goes to show you that our forestry and farms are definitely working. Oh, what's it? The prisoner wages... Ah, we so they're getting twenty eight dollars and ten cents an hour. Sign me up to being a prisoner right now. Sign me up. That's good dollar bills. That <laughs> that is really good dollar bills, but that's good though. I mean, it, it, it gives me great confidence. Is blocked for deliveries? Why is it blocked? Oh, it's because it needs the stuff that needs transporting. What's my staff situation like anyway? So I know I've lost a lot of fallen soldiers recently. I've only got one doctor. Hang on. When I, f I think I've got money and I've got no money. It's hilarious. It really is. But eight grand is coming in today. I do want to finish and finalize this visitation area. So we'll do that as the money comes in. We've got to wait another hour in the game for 8,200. No, they've all woken up and now they're all kicking off again. All right, come on. Show me the prisoners. There we go. Prisoners are here. Parole is now happening. Uh, visitation happens at 8. It should have been happening by now. I don't know why it's not. Is it to... Oh, hold on. Is it to do with the deployment? No, I've got the deployment set up correctly. Shared. Why would they not use visitation then? Hmm. Should I reassign the room? There were so many people wanting visitation. There we go. I've reassigned the room. There we go. Prisoners are now on the way. Visitation may now commence. Very good. Very good, very good, very good.
Oh, a little bit of auto save. Uh, okay, so that's another need taken care of. Yo, look at how much corn there is right now to be kind of sold. Jesus. Jeez, I might have to get another farmer. Two more farmers are here. There's quite a lot of corn there to be exported. I wonder how much you get for it. Can I find out before it happens? Oh, only 175. Okay, fine. Fair enough. But it's constant revenue that I'm always going to get. So I'm quite happy with that. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Uh, not happy with the deaths, but I'm happy with that. It's just extra revenue I've got coming in. Um, okay, good stuff. Right, my next goal then, my next aim is to make our guards a little bit tougher. So first things first, before we do, let's talk about the policy. So if they do destruction... Um, like down one hour. Attempted escape. Solitary. Four hours. So it's him and his cell. Uh, attack the prisoner. Right. Solitary. No, this... Two hours. No, I have too many people in solitary. Search him and his cell. And his cell. Solitary. Uh, serious injury. Him and his cell. Solitary four hours. That's good. Intoxication. Search him and his cell. Solitary. Because, you know, they could be hiding stuff in the cell. More drugs or whatever. Murder. Him and his cell. Solitary. Max. Found weapons. Search him and his cell. Found tools. Him and his cell. Yeah. We'll go with that. We'll go with that. Continuous planting. Farm search frequency. Every three days. Because they, they can... Um, they can hide or, or start planting drugs, believe it or not. I wonder if I now got this searched. When they come to search it, whether they find anything. They probably won't. Oh, no. There you go. Told you. They're growing drugs. And again. And again. So you gotta you gotta be careful. You gotta be careful these days. Mind boggling. Mind boggling. I'm gonna dump that box because I think that box is stopping that helicopter from landing. Oh there's trash there. Can I get the trash? Right, a lot of people are in solitary now, by the way. Right, I'm getting too carried away right now. Uh, we've researched armory. So, tasers and body armor is what we're going to get researched next. We are going to assign the room for the armory. Which is here. There we go. And then for the armory itself... We need some guard lockers. We need a weapons rack. And what else do we need? A small table would do. There we go. So that means I can get armed guards. Can we dump this, by the way? How do I get that garbage thing? I 
I don't know what else I'm meant to do with it. I'm not 100% sure. What's going on here? There is no delivery area linked to... Oh, delivery area. There we go. It's because I dezoned it and rebuilt it again, wasn't it? Right, i got to sort all these tunnels out now. Right, we'll uncover that tunnel and then build them all together. Alright, I've had some escapes again. Dude's on his way. Uncover them tunnels, boy. Fix all the tunnels. We should then be back in business. So, while I'm still researching all the body armor, the tasers, and all that kind of good stuff, I'm now able to hire basically armed guards. So, armed guards, they will walk around with a big shot. I mean, they're, they're a lot more imposing, a lot more kind of like intimidating. But if I can get these armed guards right now, put them in strategic locations with patrols. That would be good, but they're, they're quite expensive. I'll get free. Now, deployment-wise. Assign armed guards. I'm going to get one walking around on there. One in the canteen there. One in this canteen. Is that is that too intimidating in the canteens? <sighs> we'll see. But our normal guards need help as well. Because they're taking the beads in. That dude's now managed to get freaking the keys on the go. And he's going to make an escape attempt. He's going to come across another guard just here. He's managed to dodge him because he's got speedy feet. But off he goes. How far will he manage to get? Man, he's too quick. It, obviously, he's got to make it to here, but he's got keys. Nah, they got him, boys. On fire, man, these crims. They're on fire right now. But yeah, we should start to see a little bit of suppression right now and happening. Because of the uh, armed guards walking around. So in here, is the armed guard not here yet? What's going on? We should have had an armed guard in here. Yeah, I'm not quite sure where he is. Oh, now he's there. So that'll kind of help us out. There should be an armed guard we can see just here walking around. We'll eventually get sniper towers to kind of keep him under control as well. But yeah, not bad. Not bad. Um, right, intelligence. Gangs. We have one gang member. He was obviously walking up here to grab something. Something he is uh, being thrown to over the wall. Unless he's walking into here. Let's search the prisoner. And did they find anything on him? So he had a fork on him this whole time. He is now getting in trouble. I can't wait to the moment where we do have gang leaders and then like gangs start taking over and controlling the prison. That's going to be crazy. That really is. Right, 10,000 now in the bank. Good stuff. We got our visitation area down. We've got our forestry, our farms all up and running generating in, uh, generating us revenue. We kind of now need to save up then to the point where we are able to start expanding. I'm going to need to get a classroom soon. Because if I want my, my guards to... Is it staff programs? Guards certification? I need a classroom. I might have to just build a classroom for the sake of having a classroom. For some of these programs. Yeah. Okay, okay. Because if the guards are a bit more tougher, then we got it all going. 
So, in terms of rooms, then, what's left? Oh, we've got to do kennels as well. Uh, a pantry, store freshly grown fruit. So, that's another way for me to reduce my s expenditure with the um, with the kitchens, is having a pantry to store the goods that we grow. Flower garden is recreational. Might then chill out a bit more. Uh... A meeting room is a good one. I gotta get it done as well. Do you reckon the laundry room is uh, adequate still? I'm not sure. Well, we need to add more objects inside of it. That's probably what we'll have to do. But um, I think we can end it for here. This has been quite a uh, an eye-opening episode of the fact that we need to get certain stuff underway. We got the visitation, which is a lot more expensive than I was expecting. With what I paid for that uh, visitation area, I probably was close to being able to afford to extend a little bit. But uh, we've got money makers down. More money is now being made than ever before. Uh, in terms of our finance, we had only five grand in exports. I say that's fine. Uh, it's the fact that five grand in exports is amazing. We weren't. What we mean? It's five additional revenue without doing anything, apart from our prisoners working. It's crazy. It is crazy. Our valuation not too good just yet because we've had um, death penalties and last and escapes in the last 24 hours. So we can't do much about that at the minute. But once I can get these expansions underway, we're all good. We are going to be all good. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to still accept high-risk security prisoners just because of the money it generates me so we'll take it on the chin yeah our valuations that might be the greatest but um in the long run i'm gonna be generating more revenue than ever before we start to get all of our stuff in place i've now just got armed guards which should help us out a little bit and uh some prisoners have some serious complaints what are the needs the at the minute Hygiene, exercise, more family needs. Yeah. We gotta keep on top of all of this. Exercise is yard stuff and you know, they'll eventually get that. It's it's a heavily worked, scheduled environment in the prison at the minute. It's heavily work orientated. So we we'll just have to wait. Give it some time. The needs will come down. It's currently yard time, so, you know, a bit of family. That's from using the cell phones. Exercise is now increasing. I need to add more stuff to a lot of these yards. So they can really, really benefit from them. Especially if the ones in the gymnasium as well. Anyway, guys, we're going to end it here. Hope you did enjoy this. If you did, smash that like button down below. But until next time, I will see you all soon. So good. Bye.